NPR. The pennant race is in full swing, and some DePaul University students are paying very, very close attention to the Cubs. Well, that's because they're taking a whole class devoted to the ball club. CBS 2's John Duncanson sat in on today's lecture. The Cubs, I believe, as the whales, the Federated Whales, were founded around 1876. It's a four-credit class at DePaul on the Chicago Cubs. Don't believe it? Here are the students. Man, I get to learn about baseball for credit. <laughs> it's awesome. Here's the professor. We have one batter. Here's the professor's jersey. This is for real. They will do their tests. They will do their papers. They have reading. There is discussion. This is a real class. This is the fourth year of the class taught by Dr. Judith Ray Ross and sports psychology consultant Sandesh Bilgi. The game of baseball has evolved, but it's used as a release. As Dr. Ross mentioned, it's therapeutic. But it is just a class with sleepy eyes, yawning mouths, doodling on notebooks, and manicures that need tending. Still, there's more to the class than hits, runs, and errors. It's more than just baseball. We learned about the city. We met people who are living in poverty. I mean, it's more than just baseball. And to see how easy this class is, we decided to attend session ourselves for the day. Which player has played the most games at shortstop for the Cubs? Mr. Duncanson. Ernie Banks. Wrong. Anyone else? Don Kessinger. Which player has the most career saves for the Cubs? Mr. Duncanson. Randy Myers. Wrong. Above all, this class uses the lovable losers to teach a lesson of life to young people about to start a new phase of their own. The Cubs have taught Chicago diversity. The Cubs have taught Chicago to hope. The Cubs have taught Chicago that you can deal with loss and go on for another day. At DePaul University. Mr. Duncanson. CBS 2 News. <laughs> <laughs> the class of the Cubs is an orientation to Chicago for freshmen and is one of the most sought after at DePaul. Go figure. <laughs> and in case you're wondering, the Cubs player with the most career saves, Lee Smith with 180 of them. I'm sure it's a real class, but it also looks like a lot of fun. I wish there were those classes around when I was there. Uh, teacher looks age. like she means business. Oh, boy, but <laughs> I'd be happy to do that business. <laughs> well, in sports, we're going to go live to Wrigley and the Metrodome in Minneapolis, where the Sox are playing for the latest on Chicago's teams.